Well, it's been nearly two months since the Norfolk Southern train carrying hazardous chemicals derailed near the Pennsylvania-Ohio border. Crews are still cleaning up the mess and locals still being impacted by the derailment. WENY Washington correspondent Rachel Knapp joins us live from the U.S. Capitol this evening. Rachel, members held another hearing on this. What updates did they give about the cleanup? Good evening, Renata. Officials say it's still going to take some time to clean up all the mess, but the EPA is reassuring members that if Norfolk Southern falls short on any of their duties, they will be there to make sure the job gets done. For this small community, this isn't over. In a House Energy and Commerce subcommittee, the focus was about the government's response to the Norfolk Southern train derailment on the Ohio-Pennsylvania border in early February. The derailment, which was carrying hazardous chemicals, wrecked havoc in the small rural community. Doctors say the derailment has impacted people's health and mental health. Residents have expressed concerns about immediate health issues of sore throats, headaches, and anxiety, as well as unknown long-term health conditions, including the development of cancer. And nearly two months later, they are still cleaning up the mess. There is a many thousands of tons toxic dirt pile still sitting there. The EPA, the DOT, and other state and federal agencies have been criticized for their response to the disaster. Some saying they arrived on site hours after the derailment. The EPA says they've been boots on the ground every day since. There have been tremendous progress in cleaning up and moving the waste out of the community safely and quickly, including the removal of more than 9 million gallons of liquid waste and over 10,000 tons of soil. And mind you, 70% of the solid waste shipped off-site has occurred in the last two weeks. The pace is picking up and the job is getting done. Democratic members were upset Norfolk Southern was not there to testify. Other witnesses say the primary focus needs to be on the health and safety of the East Palestine community. By holding Norfolk Southern accountable to make it right, this was not East Palestine's fault. Renata, the Ohio EPA believes it'll take at least two months to clean up all that mess. Back to you.